Welcome to Bong Pa In Palace, a very beautiful place, perfect for one day journey. It is located about 20 kilometers from Ayutthaya, ancient city, and about 60 kilometers from Bangkok. This is a royal residence, and what is interesting, it was the royal residence in the 17th century. Then a lot of interesting constructions and buildings were added in the 19th century, and it still serves as a royal residence for taking some ceremonies or banquets. It is quite big, uh, so some people recommend you to get such a car to visit everything, but going on foot also okay. But keep in mind that you should wear, especially men should wear long trousers and you can actually buy some here the walk will be very pleasant if you go to bang Pain because it is not hot here there are a lot of ponds the entrance fee is 100 baht uh, for foreigners and it is definitely worth it i do highly recommend you to go to bang Pain if you happen to be around and you have one spare day for visiting it Similar to most Thai royal palaces, the compound is divided into two sections, the outer and the inner palace. This palace was originally painted in two shades of green, but then it burned out and was reconstructed. And now it is one of the most beautiful buildings too. The observatory was built as a lookout tower for viewing the surrounding countryside in 1881. And the Chinese-style two-storied mansion was built by the equivalent of the Chinese Chamber of Commerce. All the architecture here is influenced by Europe, Thai and Chinese styles. Also, there are some little buildings uh, and little houses, not for the royal family, but for their friends and guests. We took bicycles uh, to get there, but actually you can go by train and it is very cheap because the train costs around uh, 12 baht um, and it is quite convenient going um, by train. I am a really big fan of architecture and palaces, so uh, it gave me a lot of pleasure walking around uh, this site. Uh, if you are a fan of such walks, uh, you must visit Bang Pain Palace too. And if you like my video and want to know more about digital nomad lifestyle, about traveling around the world, subscribe to my channel. I will be very glad uh, to see you in my other videos and give this video a like if you really liked it. And also write a comment uh, which sites in Thailand you do recommend visiting. See you!